in Greenville, we're becoming known as a popular destination for many young and talented artists. Also, there are many big annual art festivals that are happening every year. And lastly, there are lots of studios popping up between the Swamp Rabbit Trail here on Main Street in downtown Greenville and the villages over in West Greenville. Today, we're gonna to showcase one of those art galleries. So let's go in and check them out. This is Donald Barber with the J. Michael Manley team here at Keller Williams Greenville Upstate. And today we are featuring two local artists, Ashley Brickner with Open Art Studios and Jessica Brush with JL Brush Art. Thank you for having us out today. Thank you, Donald. Thanks so much for coming. All right. Ashley, what made you want to open up an art gallery here in the heart of downtown Greenville and how long have you been in business? Uh, the gallery has been open for one whole year as of January, so I'm pretty proud of the one year anniversary we had this month. Um, I initially wanted to open a gallery because I didn't have a home. I was working out of every coffee shop in Greenville doing my art, which is pencil art, which is behind us right here. And uh, I, I didn't feel like I had a place because what I only the only things I had to display were samples of my work, mm -hmm. not originals. Since it's all commission work, all of it's with the people who commissioned yeah. me. So I wanted to be able to display my work, and I was getting a lot of pushback from places that only wanted original artwork. And that's the main reason I've started it, but it's become a lot more than that. Can you give us an overview of the vision that you have here with your gallery? Yes, I, I've envisioned the gallery to have multiple artists within it as my artist partners, which is what I call them, uh, because they incorporate everything that you see in the gallery here. It's, it's multiple art, artist artwork on display um, and for sale, and it's not all about me and my pencil drawings, it's about the 17 artists that we have on display Hopefully we'll get up to 20 is the vision. And uh, after that, I've, I've envisioned this to be more of an event space actually, and have more events and, um, and get togethers here. Ashley, you mentioned local artists and partners earlier on. Can you explain that a little bit more to us? Sure. Um, artist partners to me are the people that run this place with me. I can't do it alone. And so the 17 people that are artists displayed in the gallery are people that designate time and energy and, um, and sell each other's artwork when they're not in their absence. Um, we're, we're all in it together and, um, and we're successful that way. You mentioned events earlier and how you wanted to incorporate this more as, a, as an event space uh, down the road. What events do you have coming up? Well, every first Friday of the month, we do a big party um, down here. So the next event, as you can see on our calendar here, the next big event for um, February 1st is uh, our art party. We have music and food and it's a, it's a big party and celebration. All the artwork is changed around and looks completely different when you walk down here. So that is our big deal party. Um, events, uh, regular events that we have, we have a figure drawing class every Monday night. And we're, I think we're currently the only place in Greenville that does that. Um, we have a Reiki practitioner that does some Reiki sessions every once or twice a month in the mirror room, which we were in okay. before. And we, I have on Thursdays what I call the business of art, which is for artists who don't know how to sell their artwork and really want to get into that. Um, I have a passion for helping other artists sell their artwork. And so we, for an hour, we talk about a topic that's burning and we try to get over some of those fears that artists have. You've mentioned events, you've mentioned local artists here. So where can people go to find out more about your business, these local artists, and the events coming? Um, our website is openartstudiosgreenville.com and it lists all of the artists on there as artist partners, as I mentioned. So you can see about all of their specifics on the, on the website. And then on social media, we really uh, focus on Facebook mainly. So we have a Facebook page, Open Art Studios Greenville, and we would absolutely love you to come like our page and check out some of the art we post on a daily basis. 
Jessica with JL Brush Art. What is your affiliation here at Open Art Studios? Thanks for asking. So Ashley Brickner and I, we partner together with these awesome Paint Your Pet classes. Mm -hmm. People will email a headshot of their pet and then Ashley will pre-sketch it on the canvas and then during the class I'll teach people how to paint it in. It's kind of a color by numbers approach. If I were to go and sign up for a class, how would I go about doing so? Yes, yeah, so you want to go to the website, openartstudiosgreenville.com, mm -hmm. and then select the tab PUP Classes, and there you'll see a whole list of the scheduled classes that we have in the upstate. We have local businesses that host. And then after registering and paying, then you'll email a headshot of your pet to pupgreenville at gmail.com. And don't think it's just for dogs. We've had people submit a picture of their turtle, a horse, a cow, a goat, a pig, a cat, and a dog. Jessica, what is the medium that you're known for or enjoy doing yourself? I love chalk pastels. I love the messiness of it all. I'm smearing the colors together. I got chalk on my face, my clothes. It's great. But I also love teaching acrylic paint, so I'll mess around with that at home as well. My favorite thing to draw would be ocean waves or ocean landscapes. So Jessica, what classes or events do you have coming up that you can tell us about? Yeah, so I teach the Paint Your Pet class here at Open Art Studios. It's the first Saturday from 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. Also at Open Art Studios, I assist Ashley with birthday parties. We do paint your favorite stuffed animal birthday party, paint on rock, we can do pencil sketches. So birthday parties are lots of fun. You can go to openartstudiosgreenville.com to get more information about the Paint Your Pet classes and register for birthday party. And also I invite you to like my Facebook page, JL Brush Art. You can click on the events page and there you'll see a whole wide variety of kids painting classes that I teach. And I teach those at different businesses up in the upstate. So check me out, JL Brush Art. Ashley and Jessica, thank you so much for telling us more about Open Art Studios a little bit more about your businesses and the local artists and the events that you have here. And for you out there, if you are drawn to great art and great talent, then come on down as in the stairs to get here at Open Art Studios. We'll see you then. If you know of a local business that we should be out there promoting, please contact us at the information below on the screen. And as always, if you know of anyone looking to buy a home, sell a home, or invest in real estate, I'd love to talk with them. And you can simply go to my website here at www.donald.greatergreenvilleareahomes.com. Thank you.